Welcome back to another episode of Behind the Scenes with Red Door. So last time, we talked with our carpentry team, and they showed us how they build the structures and props of our world. Once it's done with carpentry, we take it to paint. The paint team gives the overall mood and feel to our episodes. They mold and paint all of our walls and props to create different worlds for our guests to explore. They utilize different techniques of painting, casting, and molding to craft quality experiences for you to enjoy. This is Heidi, the lead painter, and she's going to give us some insight into some of the common techniques that we use here at Red Door. Here at the paint department, we use a variety of techniques to bring our props to life. We utilize spraying, detail painting, and casting and molding. Spraying is broken down into two main components. The first is applying the primer or multiple base coats in preparation for the detailed painting. Detailing is when we get to be creative. It's the fun part when we get to start adding highlights and shadows to our props and we start to blend our colors and add stencils to make things look professional. It starts to go from very bland and uninteresting to very eye-catching. Once the prop is painted in detail, it is then brought back to the spray booth to be sprayed with the sealant to project the longevity of our props. So the mold is what holds the casting material. You are then apply a material that's poured into that mold um, to be casted. A good mold is going to capture the detail of the prop that you're trying to create. You also want it to be durable so that it can last through all the different castings and last a long time on your shelf. Today we talked about our paint department and how they use different techniques to deepen our immersion for our experiences. Next time, we're going to learn about our controls department and how they bring our props to life. We hope you enjoyed learning more about our design team. See you next time.